Let's die, favorite, please. Multiplayer Civ 6. Hey, guys. Starting off with, uh, what is this one called? Uh, where is it? Let's see. Uh, Dark Age is coming. So I found the At goodie hut. best, man is the noblest of all animals. Now Separated got... from law and justice, he is the worst. So I've got a code of laws now. All right, I'm going to do the only two I've got here. Now we'll do for Germany, plus one production in all cities. Okay. Do the trade one. I have a feeling we're well we've already met Congo. So Alright, not quite close enough to hit him yet. I guess the river gives him a little extra. Gotcha. Not quite dead though. <coughs> Alright, building up that XP. Alright. So I am halfway towards not getting a dark age, which is good. I got a tech boost for masonry. Right, we'll save that game. Submit it. Get out to the new menu. Now Dan will rise. Roosevelt game. From the first stirrings of life. So last night I went to go see a concert with I Fight Dragons and MC Lars. Um, I guess they were co headlining, although uh, I Fight Dragons went last and got to do the encore. Um, it was a good show. Um, started off with a local band called Rare Candy that does uh, rock covers of uh, of Nintendo songs. And yeah, you know, definitely got a lot of music in that vein. It's like Tanuki Suit Riot, which is obviously um, not rock, but you know. Um, and... Uh, Dave tried to ask for something, but I just lost my chance. Go to the main menu. First Rise and Fall game, so another another Germany game. Oh, nope, that didn't work. Let's go back. Yep. I think that time it went. Let's see. Yep, there we go. From the foot. So they were really, really good, and their um, Donkey Kong cover that they closed out with was really good. Um, like ninety percent sure they did the uh, underwater level. There was a lot of stuff going on, and I got to bed late, so I could be misremembering, but I'm pretty sure that's what they did, so that was really cool. Um, I got one of their CDs, um, and it's an interesting argument for the... Uh, I thought Clay must feel happy in the good potter. Okay. Let's see. So here I need to discover a lot more to not get a dark age. Oh, I found Hatusa. Mm. 
Alright, submit that file. Another Roosevelt game for me. Um, so the the band sounded more like hard rock at the club, uh, which was the Metro Gallery in Baltimore, than they do on the CD. There's pros and cons to that. So the CD is a much cleaner sound. Um, and that works really well, and it sounds really nice. But the uh, the concert, it was really awesome. It was really cool seeing those bass guitars and acoustic guitars just tearing up those uh, Nintendo Super Nintendo songs. So that was really cool. wonder. Mount Kilimanjaro. Excellent. So I will say city near uh, one natural wonder. All right. All right. Give him fast movement. I gonna oh yeah, I was gonna go attack uh, barbarians. Um, after from humble beginning after that was a rap group that I, eh, I didn't really care for then MC Lars which was really fun rap it's a uh, it's very interesting so uh, from Nerdcore there's tons and tons of rappers MC Fun a lot and stuff like that um, so MC Lars is kind of like MC Fun a lot kind of finds a lot of joy in things very positive at least in the songs that he did and the way he acted and the way he presented himself at the show um, Versus, say, for example, MC++, which kind of is more of a traditional rapper in the sense that he's, um, you know, about boasting and all that type of stuff. Um, that might not have been the best move for my scout. I'm hoping that's uh, whoever's yellow taking out that scout. game. <coughs> it was also fun because MC Lars um, apparently really likes Edgar Allan Poe and he lived, Edgar Allan Poe lived in Baltimore for a long time so he seemed to really enjoy that aspect of Baltimore. Um, he even had a song about it which is kind of neat. And then I Fight Dragons, which was incredible. They continue to be great in concert. Um, I continue to enjoy going to their shows and just... Um, they did some songs from uh, their uh, album that they're working on in the Patreon. They did some classics. It was it was great. It was great. I mean, the only thing that could have made it more amazing is if they had done Power of Love, which I really like. Uh, Barbarian Scout. A major victory only. Major victory versus Dan. All right, I mean Dave. Yeah. The only advantage David has is um, if he hits me next go. Um, he built the hanging gardens, the bastard. Uh, I don't think I attack him back. 
Alright, so we'll submit that. This has been Eric playing Civ 6 Multiplayer. I'll see you next time. Bye.